Now many people have been calling me, asking me how to load their ice block inside chest freezer. Now I want to educate you how you load it. You know, in my previous uh, video, I encourage you to start the business that it will help you. Well, like one woman called me that she's a mother of time and she don't have anything to eat. And she has this uh, chest freezer. How will she go about about it? So I advise her to start this business. Even she go for that to ask me how will she get customers that she's idle at home. I advise her to start with the one she has. From there, her business will start expanding. I asked her to go and meet uh, all this restaurant. Look at your area. If you have restaurant people, people that sell drinks, ice cream, ice, pure water, tell them that, oh, I have ice block, I can supply to you. From there, they will tell another person. Another person will tell another person, and your business will start, before you know it, your business will expand. So don't just sit at home, just start with what you have. From there, God will promote you. Go about tell people. Because if you know tell people where you are, they will not know where you are. Go and tell them, those are selfish. Oh, I have ice block for preservative food. They can use it and preserve their fish. So I can use it and preserve their food. That is why this ice block is very, very good. Now I want to show you how I arrange this ice block inside this chest freezer. In a way it will not stick. For many have been calling me. When I load my ice block to stick, I don't know how to bring it out. Now I want to educate you. Your problems are solved. So let us go. You can see, I put six pieces by the side. This is how I load this one. This one is having six pieces by the side. Look at inside. Look at the way I arrange them. See the way I arrange them. It will be very easy for you to bring it out. Just watch very well. You can see that I turned the mouth upside down. I did not stand it with it. Look at the mouth. I turned it upside down. I did not stand it with the putters. If you stand it like this, it will not contain much. What you will do, you make sure that the mouth is very strong. Look at the mouth, it's very strong. You turn it upside down. And when, another thing, when you load them, that is not the end of your your work. You need to monitor it and know the one that is leaking. If you observe that one of them is leaking, just remove it and replace it. You know, this one now, this freezer now contains 20 pieces. Six here, 14 here. I did not put at the center. Look at my center is open. Your center don't need to be blocked so that air will penetrate. I did not put at the center. Allow your center. Make space at the center. Then when you ask block, block. Use this stick. This type of stick. Oh, that. And another thing. Don't put another ice block on top. Because many have been calling me, asking me, should I double my ice block? Don't put another ice block on top of these ones. They need it. They don't need it. Please don't put.
put another ice block. But ice block has weight. Unless you are using the small waterproof. Half of this waterproof. That is when you put your ice block on top of each other. But if it is this heavy one, please don't do it. It will cause a lot of damages there. Just allow it to block like this. And it will, it will be very easy for you to bring out. Within a short, short time, it will just block. But if you double it, don't mind this space here. This space is what is giving this one strength. Don't mind this space. Unless you are using small waterproof. But if it is this big one, please don't. Just leave it like this. Two to three days, it will just block. Okay. okay, for those of you that have been asking me, calling me on daily basis, how can I get freezer, ice block freezer? Where can I get it and how can I get it? This is another opportunity for you to know how you get it and where you will get it. Just look at this freezer now. Look at it very well. This freezer now has eight steps, and each step contains six pieces, which is 48 pieces. That is what this freezer will give you now. If you are using a long waterproof, but if you are using short waterproof, it will give you more than. It will give you more than 10 pieces each step. Just look at it, it's a very strong freezer. Look at it. To give you what you want, you can start with this one. This one will produce a lot of high blast block for you. And it's very, very affordable. It's very cheap. I would advise you to go for it. It has one door. new with two compressors very two compressors very active if you buy it you will not regret look at the body is another one empty one they are still working on this one you can see that the pan is new just look at it this is inside This is where the man is constructing it. I see a lot of freezers, standing freezers, deep freezers, 